Hi everybody, this is Joe Jurek and welcome back to Real Estate Investing Adventures. I hope you're having fun and I hope you're having an adventure. What I want to tell you today is I had a question that came out from John from Newport Ritchie. He had basically asked, in my area there's not a lot of deals that I can find through a realtor through the MLS. Uh, he was becoming frustrated at trying to figure out how to work with realtors and how to um, find deals through utilizing realtors. Well, here's the thing. You have to be patient. You have to work, in my opinion, with a lot of realtors. You got to do a lot of things, not only to find things on the MLS, but also off-market unlisted. In this video, I don't want to talk about off-market unlisted because I could go on and on and on. But let me talk about working with a realtor. Number one, you got to work with the right mindset realtor. And here's the thing. I had a client that said they had called a realtor off Zillow and the realtor said, well, you know, you're costing me $150 if, if you don't buy anything. So uh, make sure you, you know, you work with me to buy something. That's just being a little bit too direct. That may not be the best, you know, fit realtor. The other story I wanted to share with you is another realtor that was called had basically said, well, even though you know, you may have a, a small group purchasing real estate. I have to have a proof of funds. Now I understand people want to waste their time and they, they especially want to know if people are qualified to buy. But here's the thing. If you have an opportunity to meet 5, 10, 15 people and you don't even want to give them one or two hours to meet them and then assess whether you want to continue working with them, unfortunately you might be missing an opportunity. And what I want to say is you got to do what's in your best interest, maybe as a realtor, but sometimes new investors get discouraged because they run into, they feel a brick wall. They run into a realtor that maybe isn't as helpful, doesn't know the market, not quite sure what they want. So point number one is make sure the realtor works with investors. Okay. They got to work with investors. Ask them what areas are hot right now, where people are buying, where people are flipping, where people are renting, okay? Get a lay of the land, okay? You gotta know what's going on in your area. Second, when you're making those offers, um, and the question that John had about there doesn't seem to be any good deals, I want everybody out there to realize this, okay? And it's worth writing down. <laughs> so get a piece of paper and a pen, okay? Great deals are created by the offer you make. So this is what I want to tell you, okay? I'm in Central Florida. I see deals all the time, potential deals, not good deals. I see it all. So maybe I see a property listed at $250,000. It's not a deal. But if I could get it for under $200,000, it might be a deal. So the key is you've got to look at a lot of properties and you've got to make a lot of offers. You have to be patient. One thing... <laughs> that living by Walt Disney World has taught me is anytime you want to go to the theme parks, you're waiting in line, but you do keep moving, but you're still in line. So being an annual pass holder, what has that taught me? It's taught me a lot of patience. Let me tell you that, it really has. So being a real estate investor involves having patience, working with multiple realtors, and it involves making offers, okay? And as you look at properties, you just got to find those properties that might meet your criteria and looking at making multiple offers and making counter offers. Don't give up. Here's the thing I'll tell you. If you make an offer this month and the property is still on the market next month, you got to make an offer again and again and again and again. Either you're going to wear them down, they're going to get that, you know, take your offer or they're going to get another offer that they accept. But at least you tried to get that property. So until next time, feel free to uh, leave a comment, share. This is Joe Jurek with Real Estate Investing Adventures, where every day is a new adventure. Take care, everybody. Believe and achieve. Bye-bye.